Good morning, Mr. Brinkman. Good morning. The raddest dude is in town. I'm like a living demigod. Rad? Did you say you're rad? I used the word rad when I was skateboarding in the streets of Florida as a kid. What's wrong with you? Demigod? Do you even know what that word means? Do you know what that word means? This is English class. You can't give me a definition. Why are you out of dress code? What is wrong with you? Good morning, Mr. Prather. What is that on your head? It's, um, it's my cross. It's my, my head cross. I'm worshiping Jesus Christ, my Savior. And I figured by wearing his uh, visual iconography on my head, I'm worshiping our Lord and Savior. Well done, Anthony. It's like it says right here, son. Rejoice always. And then I say rejoice. Good work. Amen. Amen. Good morning, Mr. Prather. No, no, no. Turn around, go right back out the front door. This is oppression. No. Free you, speech. Listen, you look like a homeless Quasimodo. You don't you, even you know You are Quasimodo representing is. a school and Jesus. Not here. Go out there and Jesus. change. Who made you a preacher, man? Who made you a preacher? I, I don't get this, man. This place, it's hypocrisy. I know it's a surprise, but SLA has standards. Good morning, Mr. Prather. Hey, what's up, Anthony? I like what you did today. You're making people look at it from a different angle, inside out. Yeah, real thought-provoking. You yeah. have a great sense for eye. Thanks, change, Mr. Prather. Change our perspective a little bit. Oh, yeah. Well done. Thanks. Hey, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. All right, have a good day. Good morning. Good morning. Hey, Good morning. Nice, nice earrings. They go with your pretty green shoes. Thank you. All right. What is on your feet? My slides. You're just sliding through the hallways today? Yeah, I don't want to. You're out of dress code. Uh, I want to let my feet breathe, though. You want to let your feet breathe? Yeah. You know what else is breathing? The space between your ears. It's like a wind tunnel. Go to the office. Hey, nice shoes. Thanks, man. In the back, woo! I'm following the dress code, woo! Whoa, Anthony, nice. Good job keeping up the spirit. Oh yeah. And the letter of the law when it comes to the dress code. Yeah, I mean. Enclosed, trash bags, but it's enclosed. Well done. That's what SLA wants. Nice. I wish all the students were like you. I know, man, I know, I do too. It's so sad. All right, get in there, champ. I will. What are you wearing? Um, I'm wearing soccer clothes. Oh, I'm sorry. Is this soccer class? Is this soccer school? It is not! This is South Lancaster Academy. What colors can you wear? Um, black, purple, gray, white, not blue. Blue. Do you know, is blue part of our school colors, Danny? No. No, it's not. Oh, I'm sorry. Cruzeiro EC, is that our school logo? Danny, no it's not. Go change! What do you mean? You're a little sweaty, but you're okay. What, is this because I made you change out your little Cruzeiro EC uniform? Kind of. 
Danny, look, I know that you guys think that this is about performance, it's about improving skills and things like that. That's not what PE class is about. PE class is about representing our school, following directions, and teaching guys the importance of rules and expectations. What if someone would drive by and look over here and see you wearing your little Cruzeiro EC jersey? They'd be like, hey, there's a, someone trespassing on the school property. We cannot have that. People need to understand that they can come to our school and recognize our students. You need to be in dress code. You're going to be fine. It's not about comfort. It's not about health. It's really about representation. All right. So come on, get up, keep practicing. You're going to be fine. All right, bud. Let's, let's go. Let's go.